Last year, we finished with a bad taste in our mouths. Not because we lost the last game, but because we felt we were the best team in football. But we didn't get the chance to prove it. Instead, we won our bowl game in a blowout fashion. So this year, we want to make sure everyone knows who we are and how hard we play every single game without losing. This year, we want the national title to come home to Lawrence. But can we actually go undefeated all year? Six eighty eight the Bull Radio head coach Slacker Gaming in the studio. Coach, last year you beat this Ohio team in the bull game. This year you play them the first week. How did the scheduling go about? Well, the Ohio coach and I spoke after the game and he really wanted to rematch, and so we thought we would give that to him this year, and both colleges and schedules were able to make that work. And so yeah, now we, we face them in this year in game one. What is something you're looking to see out of this first game of the season? Uh, the biggest thing is not turning over the ball or making mental mistakes or penalties. And those will just ruin the game in a hurry. And if we make too many of them, then we could end up losing. And I just want us to play sound football and make the plays that are in front of us. And don't try to do too much. Sometimes our guys get excited and start. Um, going out there and kind of going out of character. And if we could keep them to the game plan and keep them playing within themselves, yeah, they could play free. We want them to play free, but not reckless. We want them to stay within themselves and kind of stay stick to the game plan. And, I mean, that's the reason the coaches make it is because we think it's the best chance it gives us to win. So we need them to play within the game plan, not get too excited just because it's their first game. And then hopefully we'll take care of business. Thank you so much, Coach. Good luck. Welcome in to 688, the Bull Kansas Jayhawk football radio. And the number five Kansas Jayhawks are going to take on the Ohio Bobcats. Last year playing them in the Bull game. This year, first week of the season. Hand off to Brown on the left side. He's going to get the left side. He's going to get up the field. And there he goes. Can someone catch him? Finally brought down from behind. 41 yards for Dorian Brown, Ohio, running the ball early. Field goal up, and it is no good. Underneath the crossbar, Ohio gets no points out of that drive. Robinson back. Going to throw this to the right. It's going to be intercepted by Kidd. Coming over the safety. He's going to intercept that one. Reading the eyes of the, of the quarterback and coming up with the pick. Third and nine for Ohio. Seals back looking. He's going to get hit from the left side and brought down for a sack by Moss, the cornerback, the freshman, coming up and making a big play. Kansas with the ball. Robinson back, scrambling to the right. He's going to find a guy, lobs it up, and it's going to be caught by Porter. Porter up the right side and brought down after a 30-yard gain by Porter. First and 10, Robinson going to hand this one off to Mitchell up the middle, and Mitchell a 10-yard gain there on the rush. Second and 8, Robinson back, looking, scrambling right, still looking, still looking. He's going to take this one himself, and it is going to be... Down at the one-yard line. Looks like he got in, but they're going to say he's down at the one-yard line. Kozar in. First and goal. Going to hand this one off to Mitchell and easily into the end zone. Not even touched. Mitchell, all-time leader in football touchdowns at Kansas. Congratulations, Deke. You've done a great job. First and 10. Ohio's going to hand this one off to Brown again. And Brown's going to get up the middle. And Brown could be gone. And he will be gone. The 20, the 10, the 5 touchdown Ohio Bobcats. Already 100, over 100 yards rushing in this football game for Ohio. Something that Kansas thought they would be good at this year is stopping the rush. We still have yet to see it. Mitchell up the middle as well. He's going to get a first down on 10 yards on the handoff. First and 10. Robinson back looking. He's going to throw over the middle to Chase. Wide open over the middle. And Chase makes a guy miss. 29 yards on that catch by Chase. Robinson back in the game. Going to hand this one up off the middle to Calvin Parks. Calvin Parks, a touchdown there for the fullback. Kansas up 14-7 with about 7-13 left to go in the second quarter. Bix going to get in the backfield, but no tackle made. And Seals finally gets out of there. 14 yards on the rush. 
Robinson going to fake the handoff here. Second and six. He throws. It's going to be intercepted by Kidd again. The safety coming up with another interception. Huge for Ohio. The turnovers. That's the second pick for Reggie Robinson today. Second and nine. Brown going to get it up the middle again. Another first down for Dorian Brown. Seems to be moving the ball well up the middle with the running back. Seals going to fake this one and keep it. He's going to make a guy miss and gets in for the six-yard touchdown. Eddie Seals, a rushing touchdown for the quarterback. That's going to make the score 14-14. to 14. Third and four. Robinson back looking. He's going to scramble to the left this time. He's going to throw off his back foot and finds Gray wide open. Jason Gray, 14 yards and a first down. First and 10, 248 left to go in the second. Throw to the right to Chase. He's wide open, makes a guy miss. And brought down after 22-yard gain by Chase. Beautiful route running there. Wide open. Quarterback Reggie Robinson knew he was going to be there. Perfect pass by him. Kansas moving in the quarter. Robinson back and throw it to Chase on the quick slant there. And that's going to be a 16-yard reception and first down. Kansas first and goal. First and goal for Kansas. Robinson back. He's going to scramble to the right. Finds his tight end, Lawrence. And Lawrence in for the touchdown. Kansas Jayhawks 21, Ohio Bobcats 14. Ohio fourth and two, going to punt this one. 130 left to go in the second quarter. Time for Kansas to get some more points. Mills going to return this one to the left. Makes a couple guys miss. Makes a juke back, and he could be off. Finally brought down from behind. 31 yard, though, on the reception there. First and 10, Robinson back. Going to find Gray on the left side. Gray, another catch, 18 yards for him. Second and one. Robinson going to hand this one off to Mitchell. Mitchell finds a big gap up the middle. And a first down, 14 yards on the rush. First and goal, one minute left to go in the second. Mitchell going to get this one up the middle and a touchdown. Seven-yard rush by Deke Mitchell. Add another touchdown to his career. And Deke is going to definitely keep this for a long time. It's going to be hard for somebody to come in and beat the school record for touchdowns. Second and eight, 20 seconds left to go in the second quarter. Seals back, looking, looking, looking. He's going to trip. He's going to get drilled at the line for a sack. A timeout by Kansas. Calling a timeout. Fourth and eight. Ten seconds left. It's going to set Kansas up to hopefully get some points before half. You know he's always dangerous back there. Returning punts. He's already turned one for 31 yards. Mills going to get the chance to return this one as well. He's going to go to the left side. Got some room. He's going to cut back. He's got even more room. Up the left side. There goes Mills up the left side. Touchdown. Kansas, 70 yards on the re on the punt return for a touchdown. Mills, you know he can do it. He got six seconds to run that back, and he did just that. Mills, oh, this team is so much better with Mills returning punts and kicks. It's sad that he's a senior, and we're not going to be able to see it next year. Kansas going into the locker room up 35-14 at halftime, looking to increase their lead in the second half. First play of the second half, Seals going to fake the handoff there, keep it on the option. He's got some room and more, and he's going to carry defender to the 50-yard line, 25 yards for Eddie Seals. Going to try to kick the field goal. Already missed one in the game. Ohio did. The kick is up, and it's going to be good this time. Barely over the crossbar, but Ohio going to make it 17-35. Cozart on the option. He's usually in in this formation. He's going to get it off to Mills. Mills with plenty of room on the left side. Finally brought down after 43 yards and a first down for Kansas. Robinson fakes the handoff to Mitchell. He's rolling to the right. He's going to find Gallagher wide open. And Gallagher's got some blocking up ahead. This is going to be 24 yards for taken down from behind. Kansas is going to try to kick a field goal here on 4th and 8. And Brown's going to hit this one. Kansas 38, Ohio 17. Miner going to hand this one off to Brown. And Brown's got some more room up the middle. Another first down for Brown. 17 yards on that, on that run. Brown really making the runs today. 3rd and 5. Miner back looking. He's going to hit, hit from behind by Strickland, and it's going to be incompletion. Fourth and five, Kansas, the ball back, second and four. Robinson going to throw it up the middle to Chase. Chase takes a hit, but still holds on. 17 yards and a first down for Kansas. First and 10, 
Robinson fakes a handoff again. He's going to go deep for this one. It's going to be caught by Gray. Just thrown up to catch, and Gray's going to come down with this one. It comes down with a touchdown, 35 yards to Jason Gray. Just goes up over the defender and scores a touchdown. Miner back, and he's going to be sacked from the right side. The linebacker blitz. And the sack for Kansas is going to lead to another punt for Ohio. So far, they've given up one touchdown. Can Mills make it another? Mills gets the ball. He's looking to run right. He's got a lot of room and speed. And there he goes. He's got only a few guys left to beat. And he's going to be brought down from behind 55 yards for Albert Mills. Looks like he was getting a little tired on that run. He might be running out of gas in the game. Cozart in at quarterback. He's going to fake the pitch. He's going to throw it in a touchdown for Brad Chase. Rarely do you see Cozart throw the football, but he does. And 16-yard catch touchdown for Kansas, up 52-17. Robinson back in, looking, looking, looking. He's going to throw it, and it's going to be intercepted by Ohio Brown. Going to jump the route and get the pick. Kansas turnover number three, third interception for Reggie Robinson. First and 10 for Ohio. Miner back looking, looking. He's still plenty of time. No rush. He's going to throw it in the middle. It's going to be caught this time by Corey Mills. Defender did not see it. Just turned around and was not able to do anything. And a touchdown, Ohio. That's going to make the score 24-52. Robinson first and 10. Going back. He passes to the right to Chase. Chase has some room. Up to the 40-yard line of Ohio, 34 yards on that reception and run. But you have to keep playing for the entire 60 minutes. So if the defense has a problem with it, they need to defend it better. On the field goal unit. Kansas up 52-24. Going to try a field goal here by Brown. It is up and it is good. That's going to make the score 55 to 24. Kansas. Taking the lead in the fourth quarter, 536 left to go. That might be enough to finish off this Ohio team. First and 10 for Ohio. Miner back looking to the right. He's going to find Brown on that right side. He gets pushed and not tackled. And just like that, Ohio going to score, making the score 31 to 55. Just not able to come up with the tackles there. And he makes him pay, just pushed over, and he stays on his feet and runs it in for a touchdown. After a big return from Mills, Robinson going to hand this one off to Mitchell. Mitchell up the middle, making guys miss, and he makes the last one miss. And Kansas, another touchdown. This one, 41 yards for Deke Mitchell. Kansas offense firing on all cylinders. A great, great run by Mitchell. That's kind of why he has so many touchdowns in his career at Kansas. Kansas up 62-31, 3.48 left to go. First and 10. Miner back. He has plenty of time. Going to throw to the left side. It's going to be caught by Mills. And he runs out at the one-yard line. 32 yards for Corey Mills. First and goal. Brown going to get this one up the middle. Not able to bring him down. And a touchdown for Ohio. Over 200 yards rushing in this game. Second and one. Mitchell going to get this up the middle. And another big run for Mitchell. And he's down to about the six-yard line. 16 yards for him. Under two minutes left to go in the game. First and goal. 137 left. Mills is going to get this on the handoff, and he's going to score a touchdown. So Mills already with a couple touchdowns today. Deke Mitchell with a couple touchdowns as well. This Kansas team is firing on all cylinders. 69-38. The clock running out. Miner back looking, looking. He's still looking. And finally brought down in the backfield for a sack. Huge job for Kansas. 69-38 is going to be your final. Kansas Jayhawks improved to 1-0 on the season. Deke Mitchell, your player of the game, 25 carries, 206 yards, and three touchdowns. So we're going to call in head coach Slacker Gaming. Coach, your team put up 69 points today, beating Ohio by 31 points. What was the takeaway from this offensive show fest? Uh, the biggest thing I've taken away is we turned the ball over four times. We... Are lucky that we ended up with the score the way it was because we didn't play very good offensively and I, I want to win games and we can't make so many errors if we want to win those games. So the biggest thing I took away from this was that we got a lot of work to do as far as taking care of the ball, whether that be interceptions or fumbles. Uh, we just can't have that happen.
The defense gave up 38 points and 247 yards in the rushing game. Something last year's defense was really good at was stopping the run. What is a change that needs to be made? Well, our our defense got gashed by by a few big plays on defense, and that was most of the rushing yards. And I think that they had like what a 75 yard touchdown or three or four runs over 25 yards, something like that. So. If we can limit those big plays, then I think the defense could shut down some run games like last year's team did. Uh, we're bringing a lot of guys back from last year's team, and we for sure have the talent. We just need the leadership at linebacker and safety to make sure those big plays don't happen anymore. Thank you so much, Coach. The number five ranked Kansas Jayhawks go on to win 69-38 in their first game of the season and will improve to 1-0. and Make sure to follow as Kansas will play number 7th ranked Oregon next week in Eugene. I will see you guys next week. This is 688 The Bull Radio. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you guys liked it, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Also, feel free to hit that red subscribe button. And comment down below. Let me know what you guys think of the schedule for this year. We go very next time against Oregon. It's going to be a really, really good game. So make sure you hit the red subscribe button so you can come back and watch it. It's going to be a lot of fun. Till next time, Slacker out.